Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Uh, thanks for joining me for today's video. Uh, today we're gonna be doing the plan with me for January in my social media planner. So let me move some things off to the side. Let's go ahead and actually get these off the discs. So I need all of these. And yes, she's still in her uh, Christmas colors and I'm still doing Christmas colors on here because Christmas has not come and gone yet. Today is, I think, the 20th. So you'll probably still be seeing uh, the plaid and, and Christmas uh, for a few days yet. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and get started here. This is Planner Cake Kit 501. This is um, the January kit from 2023. Uh, I really enjoy this kit. I think it's really beautiful. I believe it's called Winter Dreams. I've already predated some of the calendar as well. We'll get to that in a minute. But let's go ahead and get started here. I'm going to start with the circles first. There's one. A little off there, but it should be okay. There's two. And three. Little crooked, little off, but I'm not going to worry. It's not too big of an emergency. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and get this up here. January highlights. So that's good. Probably put it over a little too far, but eh, whatever. Okay, so now I'm not going to write anything in this, guys, uh, for like tracking or on the sections yet. I'm going to kind of reevaluate how I'm using my sections and how I'm using the dashboard. I want to make sure that I'm still going to be doing it the same way into the new year. So I'm not going to write anything down yet. I will update you guys uh, probably when I do a plan with me um, in here during one of the weeks. Um, but yeah, I'm going to see, I'm going to see if I think that that is all working and if that's where I'm going to continue, um, you know, like marking my Sensi. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to track the same things down here at the bottom. So we'll see. I want to kind of check that out first before I make a decision. Okay. So there's that. Um, let's go ahead and do this down here. Let's try doing it this way. Hmm, that worked out pretty good. Sometimes it's easier to, you know, look down the page that way. Um, I do want to put the word habits in here. But yeah, I'm not sure what habits I'm going to track yet. I might keep things the same, but I just want to go over, uh, you know, kind of how it's working out for me before I make any, you know, final decisions on that. Um, for this page, I'm going to go ahead and use the thin washi, of course, from here. So let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, there we go. I think we got it now. Let me grab my <clears throat> So can you believe that well by now by the time you're seeing this Christmas has already passed. I'm stunned. I cannot believe how quickly it went. You know, and I probably say that every year. <laughs> but it just it like wow. <laughs> it went fast. I feel like it was August, I blinked, it was September, and then all of a sudden I blinked again and here we are in, in December. It's just maddening. Looking forward to, you know, starting up my new planner system again. 
I'm going to be, uh, of course, all in Happy Planner and Plum Paper, which I'm excited about. Um, I still have like that one Erin Condren that I'll probably end up using at some point, um, just not this year. I mean, that's a nice thing with undated planners. You can always use them, you know, and there's no, no harm done. So... Okay, so that is done. So that is my dashboard pages, so that's good. So I've already put down the dates here. Uh, what I also wanna put down, actually quickly, is the uh, holidays. I don't think I'm gonna need that anymore. Okay, so let's see. New Year's Day, of course, is the first. So we'll put that down here. Uh, National Sticker Day is the 13th, and Martin Luther King Day is the 15th. So let's get those down here. I remembered to double check and make sure on the Sticker Day and Martin Luther King Day. I know it's always on a Monday, I just couldn't remember if it was the second or the third one. But at least we got that done. Now, let's go ahead and do the banners. This is probably gonna be relatively quick because I'm not gonna be filling anything out today. Uh, like I said, I just am not 100% sure if I'm gonna keep, you know, like tracking things the same way or whatever. So I'll get around to that uh, soon and figure that out. That looks good. Um, I don't mind that those boxes up at the top are going to be just like a little smaller because I put them down lower. I just like the way that covers better. And we know that the new year starts on a Monday, which is great. I know everybody's been talking about how that's such a satisfying thing. It kind of is. <laughs> I love when a week starts on a Monday, but like not only the week and the whole new year starts on a Monday. That's great. There we go. And then what I'm doing is just putting the numbers up a little bit so that they're not taking up too much room on the day. Okay, so that should work. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'm not even going to put a label. I was going to do the Jane's Agenda one, but I think I decided to skip January, so I won't need that. Um, oh, payday. I can put payday in. Sensi, I get paid on the 10th of every month, so we'll put that there. Um, I don't think I need anything else. Oh, the 27th. I'm sorry. The 27th is going to be my Sensi Club, so I will put that one in so that I do not forget. I feel like that's a little crooked. There we go, that's a little better. Okay, so let's move this off to the side and get these back on the discs because that's how easy it's gonna be today. <laughs> So here we are. There's my January dashboard, which I really like. I do like the colors in this. I'm glad I decided to grab one of these. Um, and then there's the calendar. Yeah, that works out great. So I've got my holidays in. This is actually my Sensi Club. We'll put that sticky note back in place that I had. Um, and we're all good. So that's it, guys. Thanks so much for joining me for today's video. I'll see you all in the next one. Have a great one.